Hi, I'm Scotty. Welcome to Scotty's Clock World. The ink we'll be using today is Irusuku Ama Iru. A lovely pale blue ink. I'll take it out of the, the silver box. And there it is. Typical Japanese design. Minimalist. But full of style. That pointy piece down there in the bottom is so that you can get the last drop of ink. When the bottle is nearly empty, the nib goes right down to there so you don't waste any ink. And there it is. Okay, first up. Remove the cap from your pen. Push the plunger down to the base as far as it'll go. Remove the top of the ink bottle. And then put your nib in to about there. Down it goes. And then wind the piston up. Take it out, wipe it on a tissue, clean the nib, always put the cap on your pen if you're not writing with it, so you don't hurt the nib, cap back on top of the ink, put that aside, now we'll see how the new pen writes. Remember when you're writing with a fountain pen, always deliberate strokes. You never just scribble along like you do with a biro and such. It's always deliberate. Take your time and form each letter correctly. Okay, let's try the new nib. Twisby. Diamond. 580. Smoke. 2. Fine. Nib. In actual fact, That pen, nib, writes a little bit wetter than my Eco. Yes, it has. Putting a little bit more ink on the paper. Let's try another line. Yes, it's definitely riding a bit wetter. You can easily see that ink. And there's the pen, now full of ink. I look forward to using that every day.